G'day, I'm Alex from Fishing Station in Monavale, and uh, today we're here at the uh, 2019 Grady White Invitational. Um, beautiful weather off Sydney today. So we are headed out wide and uh, in chase of some marlin. And um, at about 12.30 today, the ocean erupted. I was lucky or unlucky depending on how you look at it and uh, I was on the rod. It's the Marlin Magic Ruckus. Lava series. Oh, he's ripping line off. <laughs> so, um, had a nice 45 minute fight with a beautiful fish, and uh, we got it, got it to the side of the boat, and got some lovely pictures, so we can tell the story for many more years to come. We started the day off at the shelf, and then um, it was pretty warm in there. It was like 26, 26 and a half degrees. So we just sort of headed out a bit wider. And as we're going wider, it went down about 25 degrees. We headed to some canyons that are out past the bait station of Sydney. Got into about 750 fathoms, and, and that's where we hooked up to the Blue Marlin. Um, it just came out of nowhere. The, the ocean erupted. It's like a big hole in the ocean, and it was charging. I guess the lucky thing for us is after running about 300 metres away from the boat, it turned around and then started charging back at us. So today I was fishing on the uh, Marlin 300, Grady White, and uh, it, was our, it was the first Marlin for, for, for Marcus, the owner of the boat. So he, he was ecstatic about the whole thing. It's a beautiful Grady, I just recently bought it. Uh, first time driving on a big fish, so it's uh, a bit stressful at the moment, but all okay. Right hand, full right hand. The Grady Whites performed so good, we, we, were, like, we were absolutely stoked with it. How do you know it's a blue? <laughs> it's, it's a blue. It's a How do you know it's a blue? It charged straight at us, and it's fat. Hey, that's why we're, that's why we're blue marlin fishing. No stripe or black marlin that will do that. He's just ripped a hole in, hole in the ocean. Just whitewash, just <laughs> mental, mental. The key, the key to uh, catching blue marlin is, is working just outside the shelf generally and um, using, you know, we were using like nine, nine to 12 inch lures, um, 24 to 37 kilo uh, line class and um, just keep the lures in the water and a uh, nice single, single hook rig. And this is the bad boy that got eaten. So uh, yeah, the, the biggest key I find is like, is when they, when they hit it and they're running, you've got to, in, in a sense, you've got to back the drag a little bit off while they do that crazy run, and then the minute they just calm down, you can push the drag right up and you can go and chase them down and fight it. But you've got to react really quick in that first first run. So that, I think that's the most crucial thing is the first five to 10 minutes of a Blue Marlin run. But when you're driving the boat, I think the most important thing is, I, I find particularly with lure fishing, is is to be just, just behind the fish. So you're actually not pulling, the starters pulling hooks, you're sort of reducing the chance of pulling hooks out of, out of the fish's mouth. And um, just keeping an angle, you've got to keep at least like, I'd say 45 degree angle, so that it's not straight up and down. Um, you've got to, and that way you're sort of planing them up to the surface, because one of the things that Blue Marlin do after their crazy run is they decide to go down deep. Marcus drove very well today and we, we got the angle right. And when it got too steep, we just drove away a little bit and it planed up. And uh, yeah, we got him. Oh, in the middle. Oh, that was a pretty epic battle. He just went ballistic in the beginning, like all blues, but he was he was angry. The, the rods we were using today were um, Penn, Penn International reels. Uh, we had the, the 50 wide reels and we had some 50 VSX reels on 24 kilo and 37 kilo rods. The fish that we hooked up on was on 24 kilo, a lovely custom rod. From, uh, from our shop. It's awesome to see um, Ryan and, and Sam from Short Marine um, giving us all this opportunity, both as a sponsor and as also um, as customers, getting all the Grady Whites together and all the other 
um, customers they have to, to head out today. It was an awesome opportunity for all of us. We, um, we had a ball and um, there are stories that are being told here that no one will ever forget. G'day, I'm Alex from uh, Fishing Station. Um, <laughs> sorry. G'day, I'm Alex uh, from Fishing Station. Sorry. G'day, I'm Alex from Fishing Station. Um, I should say, Fishing Station in Monovale. I don't know who I am. You're Marcus. Marcus. <laughs>